Good morning, guys. It's Ryan once more over at Magnum Sports in Greenville, Michigan. And today we're going to be running our very first cycle through the harvest rate freeze dryer. So our very first cycle, like we talked about in our last video, has to be a bread cycle. And this is just kind of to get rid of that new car smell inside the freeze dryer itself. So without further ado, we're going to jump into the software. I'm going to show you guys exactly how this needs to be set up for that bread cycle. And we're going to throw the bread in, in about 15 minutes and see how it goes. Here we go. Uh, we want to use a Premier oil pump. There we go. So now that we're on this screen, we got to wait roughly 15 minutes or until it reaches at least 32 degrees or that freezing temperature, whichever one comes first, before we can load up our trays. Now, again, our first batch is going to be bread. So I actually had just some leftover old hamburger bread uh, sitting around in the back office. We're going to go ahead and put that in here in about 15 minutes and see exactly where we are. All right, guys, so we're ready to throw our bread into the machine. It says load food in the freeze dryer, close the drill vein, or a drain valve, excuse me. So I've already closed the drain valve. I'm gonna go ahead and load in our bread. And it's pretty stale stuff, but let's just get it done. All right, I'm checking my seal real quick once more, and then I'm gonna hit continue. And we are underway. And that's it, guys. We are done here, so we're gonna simply open up our drain valve to vent it and test it for moisture. But that is it for our first process. And that, you know, obviously being bred just to get that new car smell out. Um, we're gonna go ahead, open her up, see how everything looks, and uh, go ahead and get our first real uh, cycle of perishable food going in this thing. So that is our break-in. This is what we get. And I mean, it is legit freeze-dried. It's lighter than normal. Uh, not that there's a lot of water content. Snaps right apart. Um, it's actually kind of pretty. And it's a little bit crumbly, but not too bad. So this is what we have for now. We're gonna throw all this stuff away, discard it, and we're gonna go ahead and start a new batch relatively soon. So stay tuned. And once again, guys, thanks for watching. Go ahead, if you would, please hit subscribe and give us a like on this particular video and check out some of our other videos as we have a, a wide array of things that we cover here at Magnum Sports. And as always, remember, shoot straight, have fun, stay safe, and we look forward to seeing you guys at Magnum Sports.